you've seen that it's brown. It lays together very nicely. You also see that there were some feathers on some of the wings, not all of them. But what this is, is this is kind of, this is what is known as shadow art. In shadow art, we take one side, the other side would be clear, nothing here, and you'd see the shadow of the wings come through, the feathers. So all you would see is one piece of glass with shadow of feathers coming from this side. But because this is kind of semi-opaque, it's not really clear. So in order for it to look right from the other side of the window, I have to feather both of them, uh, both both sides. So and they have to be feathered in a way that they're going to look right. They're not going to conflict with each other from one side to the other. And so all wings have to be done this way. There are 14 wings. There are two tails in this particular. Um, this particular panel. There are two of these panels. This is the first of it. And so I've got to do all those tails, I've got to do all those wings, and then I'm going to have to tape the whole window. And as I tape the whole window, then i got to think about rebar. Rebar is the process of strengthening the window. When you've got a window this size, you have to strengthen it. Because over time, if you don't do rebar, this stuff's going to buckle and it's gonna come out, and it's not gonna look pretty. And so when you see these old, old windows that were done without rebar, and they're kinda of chunky, and they're kinda of falling apart, and they're not really laying flat, um, that's because there was no rebar to keep them together. Okay, so, and those are those are the old, old windows. So they're probably, probably a half a century or more. Old. Anyway, um, we need some rebar for, definitely for a window this size, and with the little pieces that we have, we don't want them bulging out. So I'll show you about that a little later, because what I'm going to use is invisible rebar. You won't be able to see it. <laughs> 